This Matsura MAM 7235B has been the very best investment I've made in the business. So this machine's been so good for us that it's uh, given us four times the output of our standard machining centres. We're here at Absolute Precision in Salisbury and Peter, you invested in this machine about three years ago. Why did you go for it? Well, we, we have the same problems most other engineering companies, which is having enough spindle hours and making sure that we get the product to our customer on time. So the solution that this solves for us is really given us a huge amount of spindle hours. This is quite a unique machine in your machine shop. So why does it stand out from the crowd? Well, our other machines are four axis machining centers. We were looking for a full five axis machine and it's got the pallet loader. So that allows us to run 24 hours a day and seven days a week. Tell me more about the uptime then of this machine. So what are you working to? So at the moment, we're, we're running at about four times the productivity of our other machining centres. How have you worked that out? So just looked at the spindle hours this morning, actually, yeah. uh, and worked that back against what we'd get out of uh, running a standard machining centre on a, on a standard day shift each year. So, Why is this so important to you then as a company? Well, the thing that this machine gives us is a, is a benefit for everybody involved, really. Our guys are over the moon that they've got the latest technology to play with. We get good productivity out of the machine, so that's good for the business. And our customer uh, has a supply that's got plenty of capacity. So it's helping everyone in the business. What, what parts are you making on here then? So variety of customers that we have. So we have defense, medical, aerospace and pharmaceutical and uh, all sorts of materials as well. So tool steel at the moment, aluminium, stainless steels and high temperature alloys. And these machines, there's no secret here that these machines aren't cheap machines. So what kind of justified it for you to make a purchase well, like this? We've, we've come from a fairly small machine shop background, so buying a machine of this side was a massive investment for us and took us quite a while to get our heads around. But actually, when you do the sums, it makes perfect sense. When you look at how many hours you can run on here and how it compares to a standard four-axis machining centre, it actually works out better value for money. And you've got confidence in running all of those hours, but that's not an easy process. It's not just a case of switching a machine on. What maintenance do you have to go through to achieve that lights out run? Well, maintenance on the machine is surprisingly low. Uh, we have an annual service on it or a six monthly service, depending on the number of hours. But actually the planning that goes into it is we look at our workload, plan our pallets, because there's 32 pallets on it. So we could run 32 different jobs if we want to make sure that we've got the right tooling in the back of the machine so we can hold up to 240 tools. And then, of course, if a tool wears out in the middle of the night, the machine will identify that, replace it, and bring out a sister tool and carry on machining. But you still need people to come in, the, in at the weekend, yeah, that's we right. Do. So uh, we, we give our guys a, a bit of a bonus on the weekend to come in and reload. And you can reload 32 pallets in an hour to two hours. So for us as a business, it's a great it's a great uh, plus and for the guys they get some overtime as well so everybody's happy so what features have you gone for on the machine that you think you know what i'm glad i did that the extra tooling at the back has been the biggest uh, game changer for us so 240 tools means that you very very rarely need to change any tooling absolutely means your setup times are extremely low so on a conventional machining center you might be spending three or four hours setting each job up on this machine you don't spend any time because you know you might be setting up a pallet but that's being set up while the machine's running. Exactly. And the accuracy of the parts that you're making? Yeah, very accurate. This is by far the most accurate machine we've ever bought. Oh, really? So we're uh, circular milling H7 tolerances on here, uh, you know, unmanned 24 seven. We've also got spindle probing on here so that we can go in and we can check those components in cycle. And if they're not the right size, we can remachine them until they are the right size. So you can pretty much guarantee that your components coming off are exactly what you're after. Is it safe to say that this machine has transformed your business? It has, yeah. Um, I, I didn't think that I'd actually buy a machine that would have such a big difference on the business, but since buying this, we've really increased our customer base significantly and increased our turnover. So you're telling me that by having this has opened up the world of new customers as well? Yeah, it has, it has. And, and also facilities to, to expand our business uh, beyond our standard customer base into other areas. On a side note, have you ever panicked that you can't feed this machine? Because it is a bit of a beast. It is. When you look at you know, 24 hours in a day and seven days in a week, that's an awful lot of machining time. Uh, and although I haven't done the sums, you could probably do a, a month's worth of work on this machine in a week. 
But actually having bought it, the work has come to us and we've kept it busy a lot of the time. I mean, we do have evenings when we might switch it off or weekends when we switch it off, but actually that's not a problem because it's paying for itself time and time again. Absolutely brilliant. So what would you say to anyone who's kind of considering a machine like this out in the industry? I think go and have a chat to a couple of users that have got them and if you hear the story from them, you'll really get the confidence that it will be right for your business. Also look at your workload, make sure that you've got the right type of work to go on there. But there's very little that we do here that doesn't go onto this machine and we've moved stuff straight out of our standard machining department and straight onto this machine. And to add to that, it's inevitable that the machine will have problems, but it has 7,000 hours of uptime a year and Matsu have been excellent at responding to that on every occasion.